Hello guys, it's Judgy from Meet the Scamers, and I have a tutorial on how to use MC Edit, which is a map editor for Minecraft. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to click the link in the description, and it'll bring you to this Minecraft forums page. And we're going to be working with a uh, stable uh, Minecraft Edit, Minecraft MC Edit, which is Minecraft Edit, same thing really. So what you want to do is you want to click this button here, which will say Download Stable Branch. And I'm on Mac, so I'm gonna open. I'm gonna download this one here. So make sure that if you're on Google Chrome or whatever, to not click Open, but to click Show in Finder. Because if you click Open, it'll unzip, it, and that's not what you want to do. So when you found it in your Finder, and um, you want to open it with Archive Utility, I'll just double click it, and there you go. Or if you're on PC, I believe you use WinRAR, and you open it that way. And then what you want to do is you want to open it, which is quite simply just clicking MC Edit. And then what it will do is it will bring up MC Edit here, and you're good to go. You're good to get started. But what we're going to do is, before we do this, is I'm going to let this download while I'm actually doing what I'm doing on Minecraft. So I want to open Minecraft, and I'm going to create a world to edit. So if we go into Minecraft here, open it up, click Login. A little bit single player, and I'm going to create a new world called MC Edits. There we go. And uh, this is going to be the world I want to alter because I don't, I personally don't like using these programs because I feel as though it's not as fun to use them. But you know what? If you want to use them, you want to use them, and I perfectly understand that. So, as you can see, there's random creepers under the floor there. This is quite a cool world. Um, I'm going to make a note of my spawn. And I'm going to put my headphones in in a second, because you will be able to hear all this echoing, I think. So, if I just get these bits here. Bam. Bam. Okay, there's my spawn point. Okay, you have to remember where that is, because you can change it in MC Edit. And I'm going to show you guys how to do this. So, uh, this is going to be the word I'm going to change. So, I'm going to save and quit now. And I'm going to go into Finder. Obviously, you can use a world you've used before, but I want to use a new world because I don't want to change any of the old ones. So you want to open MC Edit, and you can obviously uh, take this application, put it in your Finder window or whatever, and in your Doc, sorry, or whatever, and use it there. But I'm not going to use it very much. So you want to click OK, and make sure Minecraft is closed while you're using this uh, to make sure it works fine. Um, I am going to use the MC Edit map. Now, if it doesn't come up here, what you want to do is you want to click Open a Level, and then this will bring up your saves. So these are all of your worlds. So I've got all my worlds up here. This is the world that I made for the MC Edit. Um, so I want to click that, and then I want to click Level dot dat, select Minecraft level, and it'll load it up for me. Okay, so pretty simple so far. Um, as you may notice. Um, the controls are similar to Minecraft, uh, it's S to go back, W to go forwards, A left, D right, but to go up and down, it's Q and Z. And to look around, you right click once, and you just move to where you want to look, so I want to look. I'm going to move here, and then I'm just going to kind of position myself here. So as you can see, this block has got like a mob spawner on it, and that means that that's where my spawn point is. And, yeah. What? No. Um, so this guy here, he's my um, character, and sorry for that interruption. This is my character, and this is my spawn point. So if I want to move my spawn point, what I can do is I can go to the little area down here, and I click Move Spawn Point, and I can move it wherever I want. So let's see if I move it there. That's where my new spawn point will be. And if I wanted to move my character, I just click Move Player, and I put him where I want, so I want him to stand there, I think. Yeah, that's good. So now it's the bit that I think you've all been waiting for. This is going to be the building now. Uh, to do this, you want to click Select. And what should I build? Um, I think I might just build a block, something nice and basic, I think. So I'll come over here. I'll select. You have to select an area, so I want to select from here to here. And then that will select it up. And what it will have is you'll have two little things down here. One will say nudge and one will say nudge. 
That one's the yellow box uh, that you see there, and the blue one is the blue box that you see there. So let's say if I want to elevate it, I click that hold nudge, so I hold it down, and you can move it wherever you want. So if I want to move it to the right, I click D. If I want to move it left, I click A. I move it back, I click S, W for forward, and if you want to elevate it, you click Q, like that. And if you want to unelevate it, if you know what I mean, you just click Z. So it's fairly simple. So if I want to make a, oh, let's think, yeah, that would be good. Let's just make a square like that and make it fairly big. And then you just let go, and you've got like a huge square now. Um, obviously, you can hold down the yellow one to move this one around. Um, at the bottom, but I think I'm just going to leave it like that. So when you've done that, what you want to do is you want to click this button here, which is like a little bucket and a wheel. You want to click that, and then this is what you're going to fill it with. So I want to fill this with some TNT. We'll fill it with TNT. So you can type into the search TNT, or you can just scroll down here but that's bare effort so I'm just going to type in TNT click that and then click OK and what that will do that will fill it with TNT and then you click enter or you can click fill to confirm it so it will go all red and then boom good to go so that's how you basically fill stuff and then you click deselect obviously and there you go so let's say if I want to make a little bit more, let's say, if I want to just do this area as well while I'm at it. I want to elevate this bit a bit. So hold that down, elevate it, click on your little wheel, type in what you want. So I might just fill it with wood this time. Click OK, click Fill, wait for that to go, deselect, and Bob's your uncle. There you go. So now uh, we'll go into the game. So we'll hold down Command, and this brings up all your options. Hold down Command, click Save and it will say down here lighting two chunks and it saves and you click quit and there you go you're good to go so now you want to open up minecraft go on login and then go on the world which you have altered so i've altered my mc edit world so i'm going to go on that and now you'll see that my character has moved here when previously he was down there and I now have the boxes I made, so now I have loads of TNT and I have some wood. So that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, this has been a fairly basic tutorial on how to use MC Edit. Obviously, you can do different stuff on it, but I like to keep it nice and simple. So I'll see you guys later. Hope you have a beautiful day, and I love you all to pieces. This was requested by Andrew. Um, I hope it's helped. If you need help in a tutorial, you know, feel free to give me a message requesting for one, and I'll get to work on it. Alright, so see you guys later, hope this has helped, and yeah, I love you guys to pieces, see you guys later.